Hey guys, I'm Lauren from Taste Better From Scratch and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make classic, super cute and fun gingerbread men cookies. I'm telling you the days of those hard and brittle gingerbread cookies are over because I'm gonna show you how to make soft and chewy gingerbread cookies that everybody loves. And not only are these fun to decorate, they seriously taste amazing. So let's get baking. Start by mixing our dry ingredients. We have three cups of all-purpose flour, three-fourths cup of dark brown sugar, we have three-fourths teaspoon of baking soda, and then we have some cinnamon, ginger, cloves, and salt. Next, we're adding 12 tablespoons of butter, and I'm gonna use a pastry blender or some forks to cut the butter into this flour mixture. Next, we're going to gradually mix in 3 fourths cup of molasses and 2 tablespoons of milk. We're just going to mix this for about 30 seconds until it forms a nice dough. The dough is going to be pretty soft. We're going to divide it into two pieces and wrap it tightly in plastic wrap. Stick it in the fridge for at least two hours. This is a great recipe to make ahead of time. You could stick it in the fridge for several days if you needed to. You could also stick it in the freezer for just 20 minutes if you need something faster. Our dough is chilled, so now we're going to roll it out with a rolling pin. I like to put a clean piece of plastic wrap down with just a little bit of dusting of flour. Add another piece of plastic wrap on top, and we're ready to roll out the dough. Start out the center and roll out so that the dough is in an even layer. We've got our dough rolled out about fourth inch thick. We can peel off this plastic wrap. Grab your cute gingerbread boy. We're gonna cut out our little gingerbread men. This is a great time to let your kids help. One thing my family loves to do is make these cookies and some of them we cook extra long so that they're a little bit harder. We poke a little bit of a hole at the top and we hang them on our Christmas tree. It makes everything in the house smell so good. Place your gingerbread men on a parchment lined baking sheet. We're ready to put these in the oven. Now the most important thing with gingerbread cookies is not to overbake them. So we're gonna cook them at 350 degrees for eight to 11 minutes. The way you can test if they're done is if you touch the top with your fingertip, it should just barely leave an imprint. These look perfect. I like to err on the side of undercooking them because if you overcook them, that's when they're going to be hard and crispy. So take them immediately off of the hot pan and set them on a cooling rack to cool completely. We're gonna whip up a super easy icing to decorate them. All you need is three ingredients. We've got two cups of powdered sugar, two tablespoons of butter, and two tablespoons of milk. Super easy, we're gonna mix this together till it's smooth. Spoon some of that icing into a little pastry bag. I have a really small writing tip on it. We're gonna use this to make the eyes and just a little decoration to add some fun candies to our gingerbread men. This is the fun part, so grab your kids. We're gonna put some cute buttons on these. I'm using spice drops and M&Ms. You could use Red Hots or whatever small little round candies that you like. Next, we're gonna add two cute little eyes. And I like to add a little detail like for a shirt and pants on his arms and legs. Guys, my house smells like Christmas. Look how cute these turned out. I hope you get to make these with your family this holiday season, and maybe you'll even start a new holiday tradition. Thanks for watching and head to tastebetterfromscratch.com for this and more recipes that taste better from scratch.